Good evening ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another stream. Hope you are all well today. So today we are chasing a different platinum. We've got the platinum for The Last of Us Part 2. By popular demand we'll be playing Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered. That's the next platinum that we're going to be chasing. So, tell you about a little bit about myself. Right, my name's Bolvrick and, and uh, welcome to my stream and I appreciate you coming and uh, viewing today I uh, plan on streaming every day without fail whether that's PlayStation chasing Platinums doing silly stuff with the kids um, opening Pokemon with the children going out on adventure walks or stuff like that or even our main contribution is playing Dungeons Dragons Call of Cthulhu role player games and stuff like that for your viewing pleasure I also aim to have up, uh, daily uploads, the um, Curse of Strahd, Dungeons and Dragons uploads should be up and available for you to view on my YouTube channel. And if you really want to catch up on anything else you can do, you can view anything previously via my YouTube channel. So, if you are new to the stream, appreciate this. Hit that follow button for me. Get the followers. Share my videos. Get me out there. Help me hit my 50 follower goal. If I hit my 50 follower goal, I'll do a personal one shot for you and only you. There may even be a little giveaway at 50 followers as well, which, which is quite cool. So, today we're going to chase the platinum with uh, Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered. Tomorrow we'll be doing the same. We'll continue it, continue. Um, and then on Thursday, we'll be doing some Call of Cthulhu. Uh, keep it by me. On Friday, we'll be doing some more PlayStation. And on Saturday, we will be doing some Dungeons and Dragons with Ocarin. Before all that, though, we'll be doing some silly Saturdays with the kids, opening, opening up some Pokemon. And maybe playing some uh, Lego um, Jurassic Park. And on Sunday will be Dungeons and Dragons Wild West Edition. So, without further ado, let's get into the game. So, welcome to the Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered Trophy Guide. This is the PS4 remaster of Assassin's Creed 3 that originally released on the PS3 in. 2012. This installment of Assassin's Creed focus on Connor Kenway, a half English and half Native American. The game itself is set and based on the American Revolution, which took place from 1753 to 1783. Like the previous games in the series, you will always also follow the journey of Desmond Miles in the, the present day, as he continues to relive the memories of his ancestors through the Animus. Just give me one moment. Uh, this camera does not like to be sh turned off. <laughs> I have to reset it. Bear with me one moment while I reset the camera. So there are various new features in this installment including hunting, naval warfare and crafting. Integral to the latter is Assassin's Creed 3's answer to the villa and town building of the previous games, the homestead. Oh, why is my camera not working? This substantial mechanic sees you start off with a derelict manor then be recruiting various professionals to your cause. It develops into a fully fledged homestead. These recruits in turn provide you with items relevant to their skill set. Completing subsequent missions for each person grants you higher quality items to craft better weaponry and accessories, as well as more expensive luxuries where you can sell to shops around the map to gain cash. The game is largely a straightforward and platinum with a few tough mission objectives requiring for 100 cents sink. Um, 
I'll tell you a little bit of information about it. They rate this Platinum about 5 out of 10. They have an approximate play time to get the Platinum 50 to 60 hours. There is 55 trophies to collect to get this Platinum. You got 1 Platinum, 7 Rare, 46 Uncommon. There is no online trophies, no missable tro trophies. And it recommends that you probably just only have to do one playthrough in order to get what you need. The difficulty effect trophies, there is none. And um, if you decide to cheat, which I will not be, it will not allow you to get your trophy. You got some glitch trophies that was triggered in PS3, but as of the PS4 version, there has not been any glitch trophies recorded. But in the original PS3 version, the An Extraordinary Man trophy was glitched. But, as like I said, it looks like it's been fixed. Oh, this camera. One moment while I fix this camera. Where's this wire? Beep, beep, beep. There we go. There we go. We got camera now. Right. Let's get into the story mode, I suppose. And then I'll give you a little explanation of what we're going to be doing first and how we're going to be doing it. I'll, I'll, I'll be quiet now while we listen to the story. Uh, by the way, before we get into all the cutscenes and stories, this game is currently free on the PlayStation Store. And it comes with the Tyranny um, Washington DLC as well, which is quite cool. So let's start the game. Yeah, we'll go ball for it. Used to be when people talked about the end of the world, we locked them up or laughed them off. Sometimes both. But we never took them seriously. Maybe we should have. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to start at the beginning with the abduction of Desmond Miles, my son. This boy had no ambition, no direction, no plans for the future. What he did have was a heritage, one he chose to deny. It nearly cost him his life. He was captured and imprisoned. Those who took him believed he could help them find something. The apple. One of several artifacts we call Pieces of Eden. Bits of ancient technology scattered across the globe. Some hidden, some found, all of them dangerous. Most are held by a single group, the same group that now had Desmond. You know them as Abstergo Industries. We know them as the Templars, as the enemy. We've been fighting them for thousands of years. Even longer if you believe the stories of their origins. I do. After all, I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror of the Animus. A device that allows us to enter and experience the lives of our ancestors. It holds the power to change everything, to show us history the way it really happened. Up until its creation, to the victor went the spoils, went the truth. We're trying to fix that, to free minds and bodies both. But there's only so much that we can do, and the Templars have the upper hand these days. But something larger than the Assassins and Templars is approaching, bigger than all of us. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last, everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him, to Desmond. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the lives of his ancestors, and uncovered their secrets. 
When that was done, he trained. He used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. We think. We hope. Soon, though, soon we'll know. That ominous date fast approaches, December 21st, 2012. None of us knows what it'll bring, only that this is where they want us to be. When it does. They've been guiding us in their own fractured, frustrating way. These voices from the first civilization, the ones who came before, a precursor race of immense power and uncertain motives. They're the ones who made the pieces of Eden. This is where they've led him, and through him, us. He stands at the entrance to this long lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio. He holds in his hands the apple of Eden, and we stand at his side, ready to support him however we can. His name is Desmond Miles, and he has brought us to the end. Well, that was a, an interesting story. I don't actually, I've not actually played this game, so this is new to me. So the first thing that we're going to be doing is getting the 100% sync. Because you get 100% sync, that gives you a large chunk of trophies. There are some trophies that you cannot miss, some you can, so we just got to make sure we do not miss the ones that we can. We're here. So, so, so like I said, the, this, the first step is to simply play through the main story in the game. Completing all the DNA sequences with 100% sync. You can re we can revisit any of the missions within the sequences at any time. But it is recommended that you try your best to achieve 100% in your first playthrough. Let's go. So you don't have to replay lots of missions at the end. It makes it easier. And All of the other trophies can be obtained after you've finished the main story as the game remains in a free roam state, which is great. Love free roam. Um, after finishing the final sequence of mission, so that's when it becomes available. Some miscellaneous trophies may come naturally during this first step, but it's recommended that you focus on these during step two. So this, we're, do, we're going to be doing step one. Um, one thing we would suggest is to keep an eye on the challenges for the four societies. So this is the one thing that we're going to be doing. Um, try to work, we're going to try and work towards many of them as we can during the first run, which basically saves us time, I mean, rather than farming later on at the end of the game. Um, we will we'll, go into more detail about that when we actually properly look at it. So hopefully by the end of the step one um, we should head the following trophies. Uh, the Rude Awakening, Mystery Guest, How Do You Like Them Apples, Heroes Are Born, Criss Cross, The Day The Templars Cried, Tears For The Englishman, The Whites Of Their Eyes, Caged Wolf, Daddy Dearest, Two If By The Sea, Grim Expectations, The, the End Is Nigh, Difficult End, the sum of truth, no good deed goes unpunished, perfectionist and in fin. So that's uh, 18 trophies just straight away from just doing 100% sick. And that is the main thing we're doing. So the first one we're going to be doing is we're just going to do the Animus Trial. So we're going to go in here, set the Animus Trial up, we'll do the Animus Trial and we'll get the Rude Awakening trophy. Like I said, I have no idea how to play this game, so the controls are all new to me. In terms of PS3, you remaster, can't you? In another moment, down went Alice after it. 
never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. I like how everyone else is carrying a box, but not me. This glitching is freaky. I think we're here. Go stick. Yeah, man. All right, I'm not. I'm not gonna need it. Let's run. Well, that's okay. That's division in it. Ah, that's fine. You guys ever played Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered? triggered a bleeding effect. You collapsed and entered into a fugue state. So naturally, you dropped me into the Animus instead of, I don't know, making sure I was okay? You weren't in any danger. Besides, the temple appeared to be communicating with you, and I didn't want to risk severing the connection. At least not until we knew what it wanted. Right. Of course. Son, I... No, it's fine. I get it. And I know what I'm looking for, by the way. It's a key. There's no idea where it is, though. I guess that's why she triggered the bleeding effect. She? Juno, Dad. She's talking to me. Okay, Desmond. While you were, uh, visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. I'd like to run a couple of quick tests, make sure there aren't any major issues. Then we got to reset. Right. What sure do you need me to do? Updated. We'll start simple. Walk to the marker over there. So this is the first trophy. Literally do the animus trial. Parkour. Okay, Desmond. Let's practice climbing on these objects. Free 
run your way through this little obstacle course. <laughs> Very trippy. That's a constraint. These are optional objectives that raise your synchronization rate. Alright Desmond, follow the on-screen instructions and kill the two Templars. All you have to do here is jump the gap. Apparently I couldn't perform an air assassination because I'm crap. They That only the free runner. What is going on here? Really? Sprint button is quite dangerous, <laughs> especially when you you got this vision. Synchronization levels look good now. We should be able to there build the world. See, Time to find out what the temple wants from you. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now in it. So now that's indicated to me that I've done the Elemis tr uh, train trial. Sir. Sir. Everything all right, sir? Yes. Fine. I'm just preoccupied. That's all. Don't forget your invitation. Master Birch will be meeting you inside. Thank you. Where shall I retrieve you once you're done? In front of the Opera House. And be quick about it. Don't expect to be here long. I'll bring her round at once. So the next trophy that we're going to be doing is the Mystery Guest, which is complete sequence one and two. Which is quite cool. So, the missions that we're going to be doing in here are Refresher Course, A Deadly Performance and Journey to the New World. That's your sequence one. And then sequence two is your Welcome to Boston, Johnson's Errand, The Surgeon, The Soldier and Infiltrating Southgate. And that will get you your next trophy. Yeah. 
It's quite warm, isn't it? Invitation, please. All right, this is a deadly performance. Hmm. Shall I take your coat, sir? Hmm. It's quite regally, isn't he? New email received. Leave the animus to read it. Ladies and gentlemen, you are requested to kindly find your seat. I certainly will, dear sir. Thank you for shouting and telling me that. Good evening, sir. This way, please. Oh, thank you for showing me where you want me to sit. Excuse me, yeah. Uh, uh, My apologies. Yeah. Sorry, mate. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Excuse me, yeah. Fat ass come through. Uh, uh. Evening, Haytham. Reginald? I can't tell you how happy I was to hear they'd mounted this revival. Gay's best work by far. Have you seen it before? Once. My father brought me here as a child. Though I remember little of it. I don't suppose tonight will afford me the luxury of a proper viewing either. No, I'm afraid it won't. On to business then. Do you see him? Oh, <laughs> He's seated in one of the boxes above. The stairs are watched. We'll need to find another way up. I already have. And you landed it. And I will watch the opera. Mm. A thousand pardons. Yes, a thousand pardons. My apologies. <laughs> My apologies. Excuse me, sir. I really need a wee. The toilet. Oh, R2, you start climbing, you have to move off that. Really? This is not obvious at all, is it? No, not obvious a single little bit. Uh, excuse me, sir. Yeah, sorry. Just coming through. Yeah, excuse me. Yeah, sorry. Come through. Oh, oh, smoochy. Yeah, cut out. I'm in an opera house climbing up the side of a fucking thing. Surely the people on the other side of the place will see this right now. On the way backstage. Hello. Rotate left to locate and hold position. Uh, rotate R to locate and hold the reckoning. Press R2 to break up. How funny it would be if I fell and landed on stage. Yeah, if I fell and landed on this stage right now, how funny would that be? <laughs> Pardon me! <laughs> really? <laughs> Jump! Why am I gonna jump? Ask I have to hold this. Take his up. Oh. 
There we go, we go to the moon and back. Oh, and again, it falls down. Oh, it's a pleasure to be the messenger of comfort and supreme in the future. But it's next second. I ain't a lazy rogue, by whom one can get nothing till he's hanged. I register with the gang. There we go, it's his pillar. A year and a half in the street. Okay. Oh, right, down. Okay. Great. Okay. Well, well. Mm. Oh, okay, that very good. Okay. Mm. okay. It's not let me do anything. Ah, okay. Well, that was easier. Right, here we go. Hey, Ethel. You should have come to me. We would have found another way. Someone's behind him. Yes. But then you would have known. For what it's worth, I'm sorry. As am I. Oh, kid. <sighs> Man, that's fucked up. Was going that way. No. Nothing. We must keep looking. He must be in here somewhere. Order. I beg your pardon. Order. Did you notice anyone suspicious? No, I don't think it was part of it. Jesus, please. I don't know. Oh, 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 Order. We must have order. We must leave at once. What are those men doing? I'm staying where it's safe. And hence why Fuck this, I'm getting out. Move! Peace, friends. There is no danger. Where we stand out, don't I? Job done. And how was the opera? Rather dull, truth be told. Hmm. Shall we be off then? Aye. To Fleet and Bride. By your command. Gentlemen, I hold in my hand a key, and if this book is to be believed, it will open the doors of a storehouse built by those who came before. Ah, yes. Those who ruled, reigned, and vanished from the world. Do we know what it is that will be held within? 
It could contain certain knowledge, perhaps a weapon or something as yet unknown, unfathomable in its construction and purpose. It could be any of these things, or none of them. They are still an enigma, these precursors. But of one thing I am certain, whatever waits behind those doors shall prove a great boon to us all. Or our enemies, should they find it first. They won't. You've seen to that. I assume you know where this storehouse is. Ah, Mr. Harrison. Gentlemen. How fair your calculations? I believe the site lies somewhere within this region. That's a lot of ground to cover. My apologies. Were that I could be more accurate. That's all right. It suffices for a start. And that is why we've called you here, Master Kenway. We'd like for you to travel to America, locate the storehouse, and take possession of its contents. I'm yours to command, although a job of this magnitude will require more than just myself. Of course. Upon this paper are the names of five men sympathetic to our cause. Each is also uniquely suited to aid you in your endeavor. With them at your side, we'll want for nothing. Well, then I'd best be on my Such way. Such a waste of paper that was. I knew our faith in you was not misplaced. We booked you passage to Boston. Your ship leaves at dawn. I shall... Go forth, Haytham, and bring honor to us all. Aim to please, Master. A daily performance. Done. 100% sync. Fully synchronization. Oh, my shoulder's clean today. What happened to the refresher course? That must have been the Animus one. We'll find out. The next mission should be a journey to the moon. Share might do me good. Mutiny. Copy ship, isn't it? And then all will be well. Are you sure about that? Of course. Have I ever led you astray? Nah. No, you don't sit right with the others. Have faith, my friend. You'll see. Well, well. Seems our esteemed guest has deigned to grace us with his presence. You might want to head back to your quarters. Top deck's no place for tender parnell. <laughs> so I thought. And yet here you are. Oh, Fancy oh, oh, a Let's see how funny you find this. Oh, here we go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Stay out of this. I love you. I love you, mate. Come on. Uh, uh. Can you hold it? Oh. I'll let you have that Hey! Let's just do something. Really? What's going on here? <laughs> ah, okay. Right, I failed. I failed to help you. Know. Listen to this, Hector. Thinks he can swagger on up here and declare himself king of the castle. Please, fellas, call this off. If the captain sees us... To hell with the captain. And to hell with you, Mills. Who signed you on anyway? Really? <laughs> that was easy. 
We're ready to go again if you are. <laughs> that was easy. This is unwise. Why hey, is that? This true, guys. Hope you you're right. afraid of you. No. But you should be. Really? Come on, mate. You really, you really want to go again? Come on. Do you you? Never! Oh, you cheater! Oh, he's got knife. Do you like these odds? Ow! Ow! Don't bring a knife to a bloody fist fight, do ya? Bitch, bitch, bitch. Oh. What's the meaning of this? Captain, explain yourself at once, Mr. Kenway. These four. We were simply passing the time with a bit of sport, Captain. How about you pass the time by doing your goddamn jobs instead? I wasn't aware I was paying you to loll about. <laughs> A word, please, Mr. Kenway. Oh, I nearly forgot. <laughs> There's your knife back. Damn. I don't care for you, Mr. Kenway. I've had nothing but trouble since you came aboard. Your problems have nothing to do with me. I beg your pardon? You're a poor leader. Ill-tempered and cruel, and it's clear your crew has no respect for you. Ha! <laughs> you were told. I don't want to argue. In fact, I need a favor. Oh, this is rich. I suspect some of the men intend to mutiny. Really? What a surprise. As I cannot trust any of them, I am compelled to turn to you. And why should I help you? Because if they do intend to betray, I'm the only hope you have of reaching America alive. Well, what will it be? If what you say is true, what other choice do I have? Thank you. But let me be clear. Should you ever dare to insult or threaten me again, I'll not hesitate but to cut off your head myself. Hmm. Are we understood? Hmm. Excellent. Damn. He to the point, didn't he? Good day. Mr. Kenway. Captain. Whatever they're up to, I believe it's coming to a head. I'd best get to work. Kick ass, take names. He's got our rations again. Claims we're not provisioned for such luxuries. It's not right. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Well, no, we need to be done. But what? Another wife and two daughters. What if it goes wrong? You there? I have some questions for you. That's nice, but I ain't got time to gossip. Probably wouldn't have anything useful to share anyway. You want information? Try the cook or the doctor. Everyone's always chatting them up. Hmm. Won't hardly take his hat off. Keep his face in too, so we can't see him watching. Quiet! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Won't be serving for another couple hours. Some biscuits in the barrel if you're desperate. Actually, I've come with a question. What's that? Have any of the men been acting strange recently? Said anything that struck you as out of the ordinary? The boys cry about the rations as if there's anything I can do about it. But beyond that, I ain't heard much. My advice? Go find James. 
His ears are always open. And where might I find him? Right behind you, actually. He's the one sitting on the barrel. Are you James? Hi. Atham Kenway. Pleased to meet you. I know who you are. I was hoping you could answer some questions. I figured as much, but not here. Follow me. Okay. So, what do you want to know? Have you seen or heard anything out of the ordinary since we left port? Anything that gives cause for concern? Some of the men have been gathering at night on the upper deck. I've only caught bits of their conversations, so I couldn't say for certain what they're up to. But I suspect it bodes ill. Is it a mutiny they're planning? All I know is they've little love for the captain. Mills has been trying to talk him down, but there's only so much one man can do. Thank you for the information. Maybe a cold steel in the heart. I only wish to see us reach the colonies alive. Fair, me too. Evening, sir. How are things? Calm and quiet. Just the way I like it. What brings you topside? Thought I'd wander a bit. Stretch my legs. That's all. Take care where you tread. The deck hides all manner of danger in the dark. What was that? Someone's throwing cargo overboard. But why? Let's go down and have a look, shall we? He's a shifty fella. Won't hardly take his hat off. Keep his face in too, so we can't... Quiet! Here he comes. Make like you're working. <laughs> oh, that's not shifty at all. I'm gonna run away. Yeah, I have a fella. Quiet! Here he comes! Make like you're working. He's caught our rations again. Claims we're not provisioned for such luxuries. It's not like right that you should feast on lamb and wine. We're stuck with tinned fish and biscuits. It's like a uh, bird crumb, isn't it? Most curious. Oh, it's nice, bird crumbs. Any news? Each night it's the same. I scout one area, and they drop the painted barrels from another. I'm going to need to recruit an extra pair of eyes. Maybe James or Mills. Why are they doing this? Near as I can tell, the barrels serve as markers. They're leaving a trail. My fear is it's only a matter of time before whoever's following it... Ship sighted aft! She's making ready to fire! Beat to quarters, men! Ready the... Cannons! Brace! Everybody down! Get down! Missed. 
A warning shot. Seems they don't mean to sink us, but board us instead. Man the cannons! Make ready to fight! I want you below decks. Why? Let me help you secure the ship. Do you know how to rig a sail? To load a cannon? To wage war at sea? I didn't think so. Now return to your cabin. Or do I need to have you escorted? Fucking, he's a bit of a prick, isn't he? Should let him die. Secure the hatch! Hey, Tim. Have you been topside? Our ship's appeared and means to board us. It's strange. There's no sign of mutiny aboard. Doesn't make sense. Ah, but it does. What do you mean? Did you think you could escape from London so easily after what you did at the opera? Oh, shit. That we wouldn't notice? That we wouldn't follow? Oh, bullshit. Ah. So that's what this is about. <laughs> Surrender, and I will see that you are treated with honor. If you wish to treat me with honor, give me a sword. Are you sure this is how you want to play it? Dumpster. Oh God. Oh God. Ah. Wait. Okay. All right. Oh fuck. Forgot to play this game. Come on. Hey. Stop punching me. Really? You keep punching me. <laughs> what time stays? Bless me. What time sneeze? Damn. I told you to stay below decks. I did as you asked. Only Mills was there waiting for me. He's the one that drew that ship here. There was no mutiny, only him. What do they want? Me. Then they can have you. Is that so? They'll catch us anyway. There's nothing to be done. I can think of something. Ooh. You wish us to sail into the storm? It's our only chance. I won't do it. <laughs> then I will. All right, all right. I value my life. Swish. We need those ropes secured! I told you this was bad. Arm yourself. I'll fix your sail for you.
Cowboy James. The road's too wet and slipping. Oh, 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 thank you, thank you. Make ready for our arrival, men! Arrival? I see no land, only this interminable fog. The gulls tell us all we need to know. Climb into the crow's nest and you'll see. Do them again, but we'll do it all 100 percent soon. So it looks like you've got to do side missions as well. How do I go back to the endless options? Sent down the planet of Angle, exclusive mission in progress. Maybe I need to do this trigger first. Master Kenway! Master Kenway! Yes, may I help you? Charles Lee, sir. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. I've been asked to introduce you to the city, help you settle it. Oh, no need, sir. I've arranged for your bags to be delivered to the inn. Are you by any chance John and Isabella's son? That's true. Yes, information. Uh, okay. Where are you old? Sean Hastings. One and the same. Uh, I 
secret seat of secrets and influence the ass of secrets one. It's done. Yes. Was there any button? Just thought I'd, you know, say hi. You have more important things to do right now. Jesus, Dad. Yeah, Dad. What? What do you want me to say? Grilling my balls, Dad. I don't know. Hi, son. How are you? What have you been up to? I know what you've been up to. Nothing. You wasted away in some shitty apartment with a pointless job, while the rest of us were out there fighting to make a difference. You are such an asshole. Are you thinking about hitting me again? Because this time, I will hit back. Are you by any chance John and Isabella's son? One and the same. Your commission is with Edward Braddock. All right, well, I'll continue on with the missions. Right. But he's yet to I'll reach America, out. and I figured I might... Well, at least until he arrives. I thought... Well. Yes? Out with it? Forgive me, sir. I had... I had hoped that I might study under you. If I am to serve the Order, I can imagine Hello, no better sir. mentor than yourself. Kind of you to say. But I think you overestimate me. Impossible, sir. This way. Boston's oh. quite a lively city. What are going to beat him up? There's all manner of things to see and do. Once you've settled in, I suggest you take some time to walk the streets. Who knows what opportunities you might discover? Hold a moment. I need to fetch a few things before we get to work. I'll arrange for horses while you do that. Don't do what I normally do and jump into the water. Damn, Spriggs. This accursed city will be the death of me. You seem troubled, friend. That's because I am. Greatly so, in fact. What's happened? I was robbed. The old Balkan file. Though I've managed to restore what's mine, I fear it's ruined. You mean the book? This is no ordinary book. It's an almanac. The first I ever wrote. <clears throat> Benjamin Franklin, pleased to meet you. Atham Kenway. You must be new to Boston. Why do you say that? You're still possessed of virtue. <laughs> to stop and help an old lout like myself. I... I don't mean to impose, but... You seem a spry fellow. Should you happen to find my missing pages, I'll reward you. Look, I'm not sure if I... It's all right, all right. If you have the time, hurrah! If not, no harm done. The thing is useless in its current state anyway. But, should you somehow manage to restore it, you'll find me inside that general store over there. 
Well, that was interesting. No, I don't want to punch him. I don't want to talk to someone. The Boston Country Journal. One penny goes a long oh, way. Really? Is that what you did? I'm going to stay at this. Ah, hello. Welcome. What do we have here on farms? to the shop and equipped. For the Green Dragon Tavern. The proprietors are eccentric, but the rooms are spacious and they do not cry. Have you been told why it is I've come to Boston? No. <coughs> Master Birch said I should know only as much as you saw fit to share. He sent me a list of names and bade me ensure you could find them. And have you had any luck with that? Aye. William Johnson waits for us at the Green Dragon. How well do you know him? Not well, but he saw the order's mark and did not hesitate to come. Prove yourself loyal to our cause, and you may yet know our plans as well. I should like nothing more, sir. Just plow. Hundred percent complete. Okay. Should go near there. You lying, cheating, no good son of a bitch. Perhaps we've come at a bad time. Oh, don't be foolish, dearies. Please, sit. Fancy something to eat? A drink, perhaps? Or is it a bed you require? We've already let rooms here. Uh, oh, yes. <laughs> of course. Masters Lee and Kenway, uh, was it? Uh, I'll have your bags brought up. Do you require anything further? Only privacy. This way. Sir, William Johnson. A pleasure. A good lad, if a bit earnest. I'm told you're putting together an expedition. We believe there's a precursor site in the region. I require your knowledge of the land and its people to find it. Sadly, 
My research has been stolen. Without it, I'm of no use to you. Then we'll find it. Do you have any leads? My associate, Thomas Hickey, has been making the rounds. He's quite good at loosening tongues. Well, tell me where I can find him. I'll see if I can't speed things up. We've heard rumors of bandits operating from a compound southwest of here. You'll likely find him there. Charles? Sir. We'd best be off. Of course. <laughs> Squiring. Thomas Hickey? Who's asking? Haytham Kenway. Is that supposed to mean something? Well, show some respect, boy. Peace, Charles. William Johnson sent us in the hopes we might expedite your search. Don't need no expediting. Don't need none of your fancy London speak, neither. I found the men that done the theft. Then why are you just lazing around? Figuring out how to deal with those varlets. I have an idea. Well, let's hear it. I'll kill the lookout, take up a position behind the guards. Uh, you two approach from the front. When I open fire on the group, you charge in. I have the element of surprise on our side. Half will fall before they've even realized what's happened. Phew. All right. Hold L2 to aid. Press R2 to shoot. Get into position. But wait for me to take the first really? shot. Really? No one heard that shot. From where she shoots the firearms, one of ten. Ooh, that's bad. Really? Oh, I'm still getting used to this. Oh, 
Fall back! Fall back! We'll be safe inside! What now? We can blow the door with those. Go on, shoot them. You are interested to blow the bloody doors off. <laughs> On with the show then. Guess they wasn't so safe inside after all. Bet this will fetch a pretty penny. Save your looting for after we found Johnson's re... Lay down your weapons, and I'll consider letting you live. I make you the same offer. We've no quarrel. I only wish to return this chest to its rightful owner. Nothing rightful about Mr. Johnson. I won't ask again. <laughs> Agreed. Your kind has no need for books and maps. Who put you up to this? Never seen a person. It's always been dead drops and letters. But they always pay, so we do the jobs. Well, those days are done. Tell your masters I said as much. <laughs> Who should I say you are? You don't? They'll know. I'm a badass. Hey, Fum. This one's got some shot on him. You might want to be grabbing it on account of your pistol being parched. Really? A shame so many had to die. Aye. Terrible tragedy, that. Green Dragon, then. I need a drink. Do not let Hickey or Lee lose more than half the health. Kill most of you using firearms 6 out of 10. Defend Lee and Hickey, okay? Um, Careful, gents. We've company. Don't let go of the chest, Charles. We'll take care of this rabble. This reload time is killing me. to have loot on them it would be a shame to let it all go to waste. Are you mad? In case you've forgotten, <laughs> we're in the midst of something. <laughs> Why you always got to go and spoil the spoil? <laughs> Love it. I don't know if was there, that was right. Look at our ambushes.
Oh, what a mid... Right, okay. This is actually quite hard. Oh, reload. Gotcha. Really? I'm used to this, I suppose. terrible Tracked my ob objectives. So.
Oi! Mr. Johnson's gonna need to double my pay after all this if he expects me to keep at his side. Shut up, you're alive because of us. There you are. My thanks, Master Kenway. No. Tell me what it is you need. The images on this amulet, are they familiar to you? Perhaps one of the tribes has shown you something similar. It appears Kanyan Gahaga in order to. Can you trace it to a specific location? I need to know where it came from. With my research returned, perhaps. Let me see what I can do. Thomas! What? Rent yourself a room. And a bath as well. I suspect we'll be here for a while. Jupson's around, 100%. Nice. Yeah, Next is the surgeon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let me see if I can replay some of the uh, missions I did uh, on uh, sequence one. Ah, there we go. I can replay them. Right. Let's get, let's get sequence one, a hundred percent sync. Then I'll call it a night and we'll continue tomorrow with the rest. Okay, Desmond, while you were uh, visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. I'd like to run a couple of quick tests, make sure there aren't any major issues. All right, what do you need me to do? We'll start simple, watch the marker over there. <laughs> I can't remember having the other one. So, uh, we'll, get, we'll get this um, full sync to the other Okay, Desmond, let's practice climbing on these objects. It's easier. That's a constraint. These are optional objectives that raise your synchronization rate. Now how do I do this then? All right, Desmond. Follow the on-screen instructions and kill the two Templars. Like that. Bingo. That's 100%. Let's finish this now. All you have to do here is jump the gap. Yes, there we go. Now, there was one more that I didn't get fully 100% sync on. Let's have a look, see. Is it going to pull me out or is it going to continue the story?
tell you the last one. Then. So it would be Journey from London to Boston. So I need to limit health loss by 10%. Complete all objects of physics. So this is when I've beaten them up. Yeah, okay. Let's get let's get a hundred percent sync on seats, uh, sequence one, and then we can focus a little bit harder to get hundred percent on the first one for us. You sure about that? Of course. Have I ever led you astray? Nah. No, you don't sit right with the others. Have faith, my friend. You'll see. Well, well. Guess has deigned to grace us with his presence. Oh, I'm right here. Oh. Listen to this actor. Thinks he can swagger on up here and declare himself king of the... <laughs> well, if you are... So maybe I have. This. Captain. I don't care for you, Mr. Kenway. I've had nothing but trouble since you came aboard. Your problems have nothing to do with me. I beg your pardon? You're a poor leader, ill-tempered and cruel, and it's clear your crew has no respect for you. Look, I don't want... Cut our rations again. Claims we're not having second thoughts, are you? Well, now we need to be done. Oh. You there. I have some questions for you. That's nice. But I ain't got time to gossip. Probably wouldn't have anything you... Are you James? Aye. Atham Kenway. So, oh, what do you want to know? Have you seen or heard anything of? We're not provisioned for such luxuries. It's not right that you should feast on lamb and wine. We're stuck with tinned fish and biscuits. Hmm. Curious. Oh, 
secure the hatch! Make ready for our...
Boom. Right guys, that's going to be it for today. We did, we dipped our toes in the game of Assassin's Creed. We did, we've got one trophy already. And with that trophy completed, um, we're now moving on to the rest of the trophies. We're halfway through the second trophy that we're going to get. And um, we've completed sequence one, uh, sequence one fully 100% um, synced now we're doing sequence two we've done welcome to boston part sequence two we've done Jer johnson's around we just got to go and do the surgeon the soldier and the infiltrate and southgate missions for s sequence two and we need to do them 100 percent sync in order to get that achievement okay so i'm going to stop here for today um it's been a long day um we've dipped our toes we've had an introduction with with um got our, our bearings and, and the, we've managed to do a little bit already um, thank you for watching um, if you're new to the stream please hit that follow button that will help me gratefully if you can just follow follow, uh, follow me share me out there so that I can get the followers that I need, I need um, if I hit 50 followers I'll do a pers personal one shot for the Dungeons and Dragons, for the followers, only for the followers, and I will also give you maybe a giveaway at 50 percent, 50 followers. We'll see. If you are unfortunate to miss the stream today, it, it will be most likely up on YouTube within 24 hours, like all my past streams. If you really want to come and watch any of my past gameplay, then you can catch it on YouTube. If you like, subscribe, uh, share comment on any of the videos I will reply and hit that bell get that bell on on my YouTube that will that will tell you when I when I upload more content so today obviously has been an exciting Assassin's Creed tomorrow we will continue with Assassin's Creed we'll get them, them more trophies um, once we got the more trophies uh, you should be closer to the uh, chase that platinum eh? So, fellow gamers, Chase the Platinum with me, Bolverick, and I thank you for watching. Peace. See you next time.